said that he scored 17 in the last meeting between these two. I don't know what he sees in his matchup against these guys, but he right. definitely had a good scoring game that night. Robinson given room and hits. Pure jumper for Thomas Robinson. He's on the score sheet. That making those long two versus being able to step maybe one and a half steps further back is a big difference. Milton 36% from three as White lays it in for his less. Finished and with six threes in the game. Well, he was four for four in that second quarter. Pell gets the offensive rebound on the Brownridge miss. Swatted away by Robinson. A nice play from the veteran Thomas Robinson. And he's showing the touch. Four points for Robinson. Well, even when Robinson with the stutter. Robinson over Pell, his first miss. This was shake was about shooting a three-pointer. And we've the, seen two already. The guys were around watching some of the NCAA tournament afternoon games and meeting with their coach. And Pell fouls Robinson, who gets it to go. Plus the foul, unless they get it on the floor. Well, take a look, and obviously last night, Norvell Pell fouled out of the game. That's pretty good defense, in my opinion. Claus was fouled, made the shot, and it counts as he goes to the line. A strong finish. Six early points could make it seven. He's made an impact off the bench tonight. Well, when we said he's in three games, not really knowing anything about your organization or your team. He was not a part of the Red Claws roster as he steals it from Bolden in the last meeting. The Euro step wow. blocked by Bolden. The follow goes plus the foul. So the Bluecoats not only would like to win to end the season, they'd like to get one against Maine this season. Pell can't get the hook to go. Interesting to see Norvell. Even putting it on the floor a couple of times. That was his first missed field goal, three of four. Thomas Robinson picks up his fifth make from the field, five of seven for 11 points. Vaughn now 0 for 2 from long range where he was 6 of 7 last night. Robinson, 13 points. I mean, he just, he's trying to remind everybody before he goes on vacation, you know, I, I've had a really good year and I'm really good for the organization. Thomas Robinson has been really good for the main organization. Final game at 76ers Fieldhouse for this current campaign. Final game of the season in the current campaign. King off the mark. Robinson on the spot again. 17 points in the first half. The four rebounds, I think that might have been his fifth, but Robinson to me is just knows where to be. See, there's the second steal and a nice. First three, he's got nine points off the bench. Milton for Bolden, getting back Robinson again. Intercepting it. Just about a nine second difference between shot and game clock. Robinson goes up and throws it home. He's got 19 now. Full extra seconds. And now we'll get going again to begin the second half. Archie Goodwin off the miss. Thomas Robinson with the slam. Nine points, six rebounds for Jonah Bolden, playing the back-to-back -back with the Coats at the end of the G League season. Robinson up and in. Give him 23. Couple of minutes into this third quarter. Tied just like we were at the half, no longer after Robinson follows his own miss. Now, the, the great thing I loved about that, so Goodwin's waiting, waiting on the rebound. Seven rebounds to go along with his seven points. And Bolden, and, powering down the middle, he's fouled. And the, but the guy who's running the floor to make that defensive play. Seven to shoot for Robinson, working on Bolden. And he draws the foul. Well, we'll see. Early in the third quarter as well. Well, those 25 points on 12 of 16 shooting, by the way, surpassed his NBA career high, which was 23 points. League with both neither team qualifying for the playoffs this year. 27 points. For what it's worth, the name Maverick Rowan is, that's a great name. He started tonight. Farrell misses the shot for the Blue Coats. Rowan has six points. It's only his second action, game of action with Maine. Robinson up and in, 29. And that one he did with his left hand, switched. Two of five from distance, 15 points for Bolden. Eight rebounds as well. The touch not as soft there for Robinson. That was. Andrew White for Nick King. Six to shoot, King goes up and it's not there. Robinson, another rebound. Whoa. There's number 10. 
and a three at the end of the shot clock goes down. It's been that kind of night for Thomas Robinson. 32 points and 10 boards. Shake Milton back in there as a Blue Coats guard with Farrell and Brownridge and Vaughn and Pell in the middle. Pell challenging Robinson who can't score, but Bohannon can on the finish with the putback. Well, it's been a quiet, he absolutely did that. So how that was, I mean, your hands would have to be inside the cylinder to be able to have to reach back. As we get going, Thomas Robinson gets going again. 34 points for him, 12 rebounds.